Okay. Well, hello, everybody watching, either on Twitch or on YouTube. Welcome to Persona 3 Portable. I'm finally getting around to this game after... When did this game come out? March? April? Around there. I could be wrong. But we are playing Persona 3 Portable, the female route today. So, um, before we get started, I have a couple things I want to address regarding how this- Oh, no, 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 I don't want to get copyrighted. <laughs> Hold up. Muting the game. Okay. <laughs> I have to, like, constantly be <laughs> moving the cursor. So that way it doesn't go to the to the music screen. Okay, so a couple things. So I am familiar with Persona. I have played Persona 5 and I have kind of played Persona 4 a little bit. Um, I basically watched someone play Persona 4 Golden and then I play, was able to play it a little bit myself, um, but then I... Uh, I was borrowing uh, someone else's account at that time and I no longer have access to their account. So my Persona for Golden playthrough is kind of lost, but I technically know how that game goes, everything, whatnot. As for Persona 3, uh-oh. <laughs> As for uh, Persona 3 Portable, um, I have played Persona 3 Portable already. I have played the Mail Route. And I watched someone play the FES version for the Mela as well. So I am already familiar with this game. Thank you for the Vine Boom Potato. Um, I am already familiar with this game. So, and since I technically have seen Persona 3 Portable twice, I'm going to be playing the female route today, which unfortunately is not going to be in that... Uh, the remake that they're releasing next year, which is kind of a, bu a bummer. So I want to get this playthrough before hope uh, finish before next year. But another thing is, since I have technically already seen this game twice, I do want to 100% the female route. Um, normally, if I had enough time on my own, I would probably play the female route on my own time. Um, Com somewhat blind free and then play it again and make my own schedule but because I'm most likely only be gonna I'm only going to be playing this route once I'm going to follow a schedule guide um only for um only for like social links and what I should be doing for the day I'm not going to be using a guide for uh Tartarus or the dark hour or like using personas like none of that all of that I'm going to be I'm going to be using uh, my own knowledge for. Hello, Morose, welcome. I'm going to be using my own knowledge for. It's only because I want to get 100% completion because I'm most likely not going to be picking up this game a second time. Um, and another thing, if any of you out there have not played Persona 3 or plan on getting into Persona 3, um, I highly recommend you don't watch this playthrough because um, the... Oops. The... Canon route is actually the male route. Um, and the female route was something that was added when they made Persona 3 Portable. Um, and the routes are different. Um, the social links are different. Your interactions are different. Uh, the story, I have no idea. I actually managed to keep myself pretty spoiler free when it came to the female route. So uh, I, I unfortunately know how the game ends though. <laughs> the only thing I know is the ending, which is the worst thing to know, but I know how this, how the female route ends. Um, but I highly recommend if you plan on playing Persona 3 or want to get into Persona 3, do not watch this playthrough because um, the game itself themselves recommends, like Alice themselves, or actually I think they say it in this game, they recommend you do the male route first before the female route, and they are different from each other. So uh, I'm sorry if you were looking forward to this playthrough, but um, <laughs> if you if you uh, haven't seen male route, do not watch this. I have to repeat that myself a couple times. I'll probably be on and off. I don't see myself ever feeling the need to play Persona 3. Anyway, no problem, food. I'm just driving by. I need to sleep. Have a good stream. Oh, yeah, Potato. Thank you so much for... Oh, shoot. Thank you so much uh, for... Mute. Mute. <laughs> okay. I keep forgetting. I need to constantly be doing that. Okay. Uh, thank you so much for dropping by, guys, and it's okay if you need to lurk or if you need to go to bed due to time zones, whatnot. Everything's perfectly... Okay. 
Uh, so, I guess without further ado, I guess we'll get started. So, yeah, we're going for the 100% route. Gonna be using a schedule guide. Um, not for Tartarus or for the or the dungeons or whatnot. Not for fusing or anything. Um, just for social links and for stats and whatnot. I gotta love, though, that Atlas had the option to fix issues of a two different ways to play Persona 3 by creating another Persona 3 per version with missing content oh yeah so <laughs> if you're gonna play the mail route i highly recommend picking up fes not portable because <laughs> portable um kind of takes away some things in the mail route uh that's in the fes version so i would i would recommend if you're gonna play the mail route fes not portable but uh the female route is only in portable so that's why i play portable and whatnot okay but i am playing this game on my pc uh, i'm using um my ps5 controller though however um i didn't want to stream this on my ps5 because last time i tried streaming on my ps5 it wasn't quite reliable when i was playing soul hackers 2 but i think i've chatted on long enough so let's go ahead and get started so yep experienced player here but not completely uh, a professional so welcome to the world of persona 3 portable in this game you can select the gender of the main character to the course of the game will change based on the main character's gender. By choosing a male main character, you'll be able to play a version very close to the original P3. This is recommended for new players who have yet to experience P3. The female main character added to this game is not just for female players. She's also for veterans of Persona 3 and Persona 3 FES who want a new perspective. Now please choose a gender. So like I said, I've already played the male route before, so we're going for the female. Yes. Okay. I'm going to choose normal difficulty here because um as i like to think i'm pretty knowledgeable about persona but i don't think i'm i wouldn't consider myself like a veteran of this game or very good at it i kind of pick up as i go um so i'm just gonna go for normal for now like i don't i don't normally like to challenge myself with games i just like to because if it's too hard, then I stop having fun. And normal is always... I don't know. Normal is just a good difficulty for me in general. Alright. Time to enjoy the game. This game is a work of fiction. No persons, groups, incidents, or... Blah, 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 blah. Basically, don't take this game <laughs> as a, a reference for life. <laughs> Basically. Time never waits. It delivers all equally to the same end. You who wish to safeguard the future, however limited it may be, you will be given one year... Go forth without falter, with your heart as you guide. Okay. And here we go, we begin. Story, Monaco. Already the opening scene is much different compared to the mail route. Terminal station evening. Oh, it's actually not that different. <laughs> put it to my head. Pull the trigger. No chickening out. No, I can't. Due to a malfunction in the switching system, today's real schedule has been greatly altered. You carry. If you don't know anything about this game, that may look like <laughs> that that scene is not what it looks like. Oh, by the way, how does the game sound? Can you guys hear it? As in compared to my voice, that is. I maybe I should turn up just a smidge. You arrived late. Oops. It's almost midnight. The dark hour. Mm. 
Tan, tan, tan. Something about the atmosphere seems odd. It would probably be best to hurry to the dorm. As you walk from the station, you notice coffin-like objects lining the, des the deserted city. Very creepy. Are there bodies in there? Almost gives like that post... Uh, oh no. The Twilight Zone? Yeah. <laughs> it's an eerily gigantic moon. And here we are at school. Okay. I might butcher this high school name. Forgive me. Gekkokan High School. Iwatodai Dorm. This is the dorm mentioned in your admission pamphlet. And it is now our first night at school. At the Welcome. dark hour. Dude, this is crazy. Like, if I was... Okay, here's the thing. I know the technically the canon name for <laughs> the female pers uh, protagonist is Kotone. Um, Kotone started with an S. Tone Shiomi, I think that was it. But I'm so used to calling her Minako because that was her name before, like, <laughs> before they released the canon name. I don't know. I might You're accidentally late. slip and call her Minako. I've been waiting a long time. It's the creepy boy. An unknown boy is holding a piece of paper out to you. If you want to proceed, then please sign here. There's no Oops. need to be scared. It only binds you to accepting full responsibility. Oh, what happened to your voice? For your actions. Something is written on the paper he's holding out to you. I chose it this fate of my own free will. Below it is a blank to sign your name. All right, and this is where we decide the name. I'm already really conflicted whether I name her Minako or Kotone. Hmm. Because, I don't know. I'm just so used to calling her Minako, but I always, typically whenever games give me the option to name a character, I like to go with the canon name. And in this case, uh, uh, Katone is... Oh shoot, I just dropped my phone. I'm sorry about that. Is the canon name, so maybe I will go with Katone. I'm thinking. Mm, yeah. All right, here we go. To... To... Nay. Oops, that's capital. B button. I can't delete? Why can I not delete? There we go. Katone. Okay. And how do I enter? <laughs> Wait, these are... Oh, here we go. Last name. She... I got this. She... O... Me. Alright, I'm just gonna double check to make sure I spelled that right. I did. Okay, wonderful. Now we begin. Katone Shiomi. Ah! <clears throat> Proceed? Yes. And I find it always... Very it's well. always weird how they have, like, separate kind of names like what's the or separate names in general like what's the point of that <laughs> time is something no one can escape this guy may seem it like an enemy the but end. the devil is our friend in this case won't make it go away and so it begins the dark hour the unknown boy disappeared as if melting into the darkness who's there oh how can you <gasps> hello be? but it's don't tell Woman. Me. The girl's holding something that looks like a gun. Wait. <gasps> we got our two gals right what? off the bat. I didn't think you'd arrive so late. My name is Mitsuru. Hey, Kibita. Mitsuru. I'm one of the students who live in the storm. Who's she? I'm trying to think uh who I prefer over these two. She's a transfer. I think they're maybe Yukari. If I were to choose a best girl. 
<laughs> but actually, my real world. best girl shows up a lot later, so <laughs> I can't really spoil. Is it okay for her to be here? I, or, guess I technically we'll can. This is Yukari because Kamina. most people should be playing the female route after the male route. She'll be a junior this <laughs> I like Aegis. Just like you. <laughs> Hi, I'm Yukari. Hi, Yukari. Um, nice to meet you. Uh, yeah. This is nice all normal. You too. <laughs> no questions okay. asked. You'll find your room on the third floor. Your thing should already be there. I oh, Oops. I'll show you the way. Follow me. No problem. Dormitory third floor hallway at the furthest door. This is it. My room. Pretty easy to remember, huh? Since it's right at the end of the hall. So, any questions? I signed a contract. Cause that boy live here. I signed huh? a contract. What's this about a contract? And yet none of you can see the boy. Yukari doesn't seem to know what you're talking about. Um, can I ask you something? No. On your way here from the station, was everything okay? Uh, you do you mean those creepy corpses that happened? You know what I... The tombs? Never mind. It seems like you're all right. <laughs> well, ac according to, uh, Kotone, all of that is completely normal, not worth addressing. Well, I better get going. Um, I'm sure you still have other questions, but let's save them for later, okay? Okay. Good night. Good night. Our first night, a new place, a new room, and new people, and apparently a new world. Kari walked down the stairs. This is your assigned room. Okay. Um, I don't think I need to read these. Oh, the room is so cute. In the mail route, it's all blue instead of pink. Okay. Let's do... What should the first thing I do be? Should I introduce myself? You're all tired today. You should go to bed early. Oh. Can't even look at myself in the mirror? My regular face. Uh, well, I guess that, that is a clue that nothing is normal in this game. E that the fact that they have to s state the fact that your mirror is actually normal. Oh, boy. And I can probably look at stuff, but I don't think it's going to let me do anything. You're all tired today. You should go to bed. But what if I don't want to... Oh. I've never actually properly looked at this calendar. It's all empty though. <laughs> Finals! Shoot. Okay. Guess we'll just head to bed. You tired today? You should go to bed early. Sleep. And we start our next day Tuesday. It's Yukari. Are you awake? No, let me sleep in. Good morning. Did you sleep okay? Mitsuru Sanpai asked me to take you to school. Are you ready to go? Totally. Okay. Then let's I'm not go. gonna reject a new fright on the first day. Inside the new city passenger train on a Hazuru. We have to take the monorail to get there. Bet your last school wasn't like that, huh? This is my favorite part. When it feels Kinda like sad we don't really know anything about our past just yet. I imagine she's gonna have like the same exact backstory as the male protagonist, but you never know. Our stop is Port Island Station at the end of the line. From there, we walk. Okay. Have you ever heard of Tatsumi Port Island? It's a man-made island. They built our school right in the middle. Oh look, you can see it now. Wow, the cherry blossoms are so pretty. I wish it was spring again. Morning. Spring is my, I switch between spring and autumn being my favorite Morning. season. Well, here we are. Welcome to Gekukan High. You're gonna love it here. You're okay from here, right? You should go see your homeroom teacher first. Okay. So, I do know that the social links in the female route are a bit different. Like, um, like, they're a whole different character, some of them. Some of the social links are completely different characters. So, let's see if this is our the same teacher from the mail route, or if it's a different one. Oh, the heck. There to the Sorry, left. my game kind of bugged out there for some reason. And that concludes the tour. Do you have any questions? Of this entire school? Yukari didn't have that necklace in the mail route, did she? Where's my classroom? I think they're posted on the bulletin board, but I haven't checked yet either. Hey. What? About last night, 
don't tell anyone what you saw. Oh, so okay? she she is aware that I probably saw all of the the corpses outside. It's been a hot minute since I played uh, portable mail route, so I don't remember all of the similarities. Like I can't like pinpoint what's similar, what's different just yet. <laughs> There are many people standing in front of the bulletin board. Okay. Let's, uh... Go to the faculty office, probably? Two students are talking. Oh, it's, uh... Yuko and... Oh, what was your name? These two were social links in the mail route. I don't know if they're gonna be social links here, but we'll find out. Oh, Kaz. Kazu? Kazuma? Kazuki? Hey, Kaz. Why are you wearing your PE uniform? School just started! You really ought to find somewhere to change it to some normal clothes. Ugh, I guess. Okay, okay, fine. Quit glaring at me like that. Hey, where's the bulletin, bulletin board with the homerooms posted? I read that as hormones for a second. <laughs> it's right there. You're in class F, Kaz. I'm in a different homeroom, so I can't keep an eye on you. <sighs> I worry about you sometimes. <laughs> hey. Huh? The faculty office? Um, I think it's that way. Actually, I'm new here, so you should probably ask someone else. Anyone else with a very noticeably out design? A parent teacher. <laughs> Kids these days don't know how to show respect to their elders. Well, they're teachers. We've lived longer than them. But Moriyama and her gang had to pull that on me at the very beginning of the term. I'm sorry, sir, but I have to go. It's time to place my order. So you're shooing me away? Some way to start the school year. I don't think my nerves can take this. All right, I get it. You want me to order more of those cream-filled breads you like so much, right? You could have just asked. <laughs> Poor gal. Okay. Uh, where's the faculty office? Here? I remember. It's been too long. Here we go. And, oh, you... Oh, it's Bebe and... Uh, I forgot who you are. Or if you're new. A man wearing a kabuto who looks like a teacher is talking to a foreign male student. Um... Do you see? Every man must have the passionate samurai spirit within him. At our school, we encourage our students to think like samurai in order to accomplish great things. Z uh, French accent, okay. That's fantastic! The teachings of Bushido are important then as they are now! Yes, yes, yes. You may not be a native of this land, but the spirit of the samurai flows through you just the same. I seem to be having fun. I mean, we'll get proper time- Ooh, you're a new social link. For sure. Uh, we'll get time to meet all these other people, but I guess we can look at you since you're new. Hmm? Strange. It says this is the library here, but I was just in one down the hall. Was that just another classroom? <laughs> Alright. Poor gal, poor gal. Okay. Uh, faculty office, library, nurse's office. There we go. Enter. Oh, are you the new student? Yup. So you used to be a social link. I don't think you're gonna be in this one. Kotone Shiomi. Grade, correct? Oh wait, did she say that? Oh, no, it's because it's my name. The teacher's flipping through pages in a file. Wow, you've lived in a lot of different places. Yeah, that's what happens when you're an orphan. Let's see. In 1999, that was what, uh, 10 years ago? Your parents... <gasps> I'm sorry. I've been so busy I didn't have time to read this beforehand. Sheesh. Sorry, <laughs> I, teach I mean, it was 10 years ago, I'm sure. Um, I'm sure we've gotten over it, right? <laughs> uh, Pleased to meet you. Why? Oh Aren't you polite? Girls like you should be an example for others. Have you seen the classroom assignments? You're in 2F. That's my class. But first, we need to go to the auditorium. The welcoming ceremony will be starting soon. Follow me. Okay. As you begin the new school year... Yes. I'd like each of you to remember the proverb... If a job's worth doing... It's worth doing well. When applied to The principals in this game are always so means... pudding looking. <laughs> the principal continues with his speech. You can hear the students around you whispering about something. I heard got a transfer student. Me? Yep. I've seen her too. Uh-oh. They're already hitting on me. 
I hear talking. I believe it's someone in Ms. Toriyumi's class. Shh, be quiet. You're going to get me in trouble. Hey, the student does not reflect the teacher. Doesn't seem like the rumors will stop anytime soon. Already making rumors and all I did was just be a transfer student. No room is over. Your first after-school session is about Sup, to begin. <gasps> Jude Pei! Second best <laughs> boy! Like a deer in headlights. <laughs> These are both so mean. Me? Me. I'm June Pei Iori. Nice hey, buddy! I transferred here when I was in eighth grade. I know how tough it is being the new kid. So I thought I'd check up on you. Make sure you weren't freaking out on your first day. That's very kind of you. Uh, at it again, huh? Honestly, is there any girl you wouldn't hit on? Did you ever think you might be bothering someone? Oh no. What? <laughs> but I was just being friendly. <laughs> Our, automatically, the first thing Junpei does is hit on us. Oh wow. MC Rat, let's go. If harem? So. No, I'm not gonna do a harem. I have someone in mind who I want to date. Anyway, some coincidence that we'd be in the same homeroom, huh? Oh yeah, very coincidental. Who would have thought? I'm glad to have a friend. I want to be nice. I have a friend. Oh, you mean me? Hey, I, I, I'm. I had to move from place to place, and I probably did have a lot of friends because of that. Please, I get attached so easily. Yeah, I. I'm glad we ended up in the same class too. Um, hello. <laughs> she sounded like she was Forget forcing it there. Class too. Come on, let me in on the fun. Ow. By the way, do you guys know each other? I heard you two came to school together this morning. A couple of cuties like you walking side by side. Oh my god. <laughs> the whole class was buzzing about you. Dude, pay. You're lucky this is 2010. <laughs> Ugh, could you just cut it out? I hate dealing with rumors like that. I mean, I'm used to it, but she just got here, you know? Don't you feel bad spreading rumors like that? Oh, you tell him. Go off. Well, I've got to go take care of some archery team stuff. Damn, Don't girl boss. Funny. You got that, Junpei? <laughs> I just remembered she calls him Stupe from Tide to Tide. It's so funny. <laughs> what is she, your nanny? I mean, I don't mind. Well, just to clear something up, I seriously didn't come over here to hit on you or anything. I mean, it it didn't really feel like that, but <laughs> if you say so. No problem. You can tell your old pal Junpei about it. Alrighty, I can tell he's gonna treat me like a like a, like a sister. I just all right, automatically get that vibe. Girl, why do you want to be so mean? What the hell? Why are there such mean, <laughs> mean options? <laughs> cool. Why would I well, want to be mean to Junpei? Around, Junpei caught up to you in the halls and persuaded you into letting him walk you back to the dorm. Whoa. Check out the jocks on the run. Hey, did anyone tell you about this? Oh yeah, yet? the clubs. We got to make sure we manage those. Girls can join too, so why not do it if you're interested? Uh. What do you mean? I, you say that like girls never used to be able to join clubs. You'd be joining as a new member, though, so you won't be able to apply for a little while. You made small talk with Junpei while walking back. There's a sign-in sheet on the con uh, bleh, counter. I'm gonna say computer. All right, we unfortunately cannot save whenever we want to. Hey, Mitsuru. Okay, our first save. Let's go. All right, now, uh, the first thing I'm going to do is, uh, talk to you, Kari. Oh, hi. What are you doing? Uh, just looking around. Well, there's not much to see. You're probably pretty tired, huh? Maybe you should go to bed early tonight. Aw, why does everyone want to go to bed? You really shouldn't be outside on your own at night. It's dangerous. Anyway, you must be tired. You should get a good night's rest. Can I meet anyone else? Oh! Oh, thank you for the follow, uh, Rengoku. I appreciate it. <laughs> I appreciate it so much. Thank you for the follow. Oh, gosh. Oh, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> I hope uh, that uh, whether this is your first time joining a stream or whether you've popped in before or not, uh, that uh, me starting this game will be satisfactory. Okay, um, where's Junpei? Can I talk to him before I go to bed by any chance? Hmm, probably not. Uh, vacant room. 
The second floor. Oh, Akihiko, please. Can I meet Akihiko right now, please? <gasps> yes, 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 yes. Playing same game? Oh, perfect, perfect. Okay, hopefully you don't get any spoilers or hopefully you're following along or not. Oh, I also, no spoilers for me too, but uh, uh, I am gonna do a completionist run. So, woo, here we go. Oh, Akihiko. Okay, I guess already based off my reaction, you guys probably know who my best boy is and who I'm probably gonna date later on. So, I'm Suru. I'm busy now. Sorry, but could you come back later? No! <gasps> no! Okay, fine. I mean, we had to wait some time to meet him in the... In the in the mail route too, so. Stu Pei, I mean June Pei. <laughs> June Pei is not here. <laughs> oh my God. I already caught on to that nickname. It just, it, it rolls off the tongue so well. Uh, go back. Feel tired, she gets some rest. First two days of traveling. Later at the dormitory lounge, a young man walked down the stairs as Mitsuru was reading a book. I'm going out for a <gasps> There he is, there he is, there he is. Hmm? <laughs> Have you seen the newspapers lately? I know. People who had no problems before are suddenly developing... I'm so excited to see how his route, um, runs, uh, in this... Sorry, run? <laughs> I was looking at chat. How the... How his, uh... Lost for words. How his social link goes with the female. Apath... Apathy syndrome. Quite often lately. Completion run! Ah, yeah, let's go! We're gonna try our best to 100% this game! Let's go! Because I'm probably but... not going to ever pick it up again, so might as well... Try to get the best experience as possible. Yeah, right. It has to be them. Oh, that face. Otherwise, it's not worth my time. Wait, what do you mean no? You have a one-track mind. Will what do you, you mean okay no? On your own? Don't worry. I'm just getting a little practice. <sighs> this isn't a game, Akihiko. Not possible. Well, I can I can try. <laughs> it, it's definitely we can definitely try. You overhear a conversation. Did you hear the rumor? Oh, um, uh, something about a bathroom? N no, not that one. I mean the story about the first year student. Not only did she stop coming to school, she does nothing but sit and stare at the walls all day. Ooh, possible social link. If her mother tries to talk to her, she only mutters to herself, It's coming. It's coming. Huh. How about that? You don't believe me? The first bell has rung. Huh. Already the afternoon. Open your textbooks and we'll take a look at the first novel by Zenzo Kasai. Ugh. Why him? I'd rather teach Uts Utsubo Kubota. Damn, don't, don't talk about your opinions in the classroom. <laughs> he became famous as a singer, but he's also produced fine literature. I wonder why it's not in the textbook. Well, I'll just bring Kubota's book next time. Oh, that also sounds like something for later. Hey, Junpei, were you listening? What did I say was my favorite author? Uh-oh. Are you going to prove your stupay? Oops. Who does she like? <laughs> this poor boy. This, this poor boy. This poor, poor boy. Wait, I need to sneeze. I need to sneeze? No, it went away. That's right! So you're listening to me after all. <laughs> well, you know I like to pay attention. Man, you saved my bacon, Katone. You hear your classmates whispering. Katone gave him the answer. She must pay attention in class. He became slightly more popular. Your charm is increased, our first dad gain. Let's go. Class has ended for today. There's nothing to do, so you decide to go back to the dorm. What do you mean? Well, this is usually how all Persona games start. It takes a while before you can get into the schedule of things. Dormitory Lounge. Your car is already here, talking with an unfamiliar man. Oh, she's back. So, this is our new guest. You. Good evening. Hello. My name is Shuji Ikutsuki. I'm the chairman of the board for your school. Ikutsuki. <laughs> Hard to say, isn't it? Ikutsuki. No, I think I got it. That's why I don't like introducing myself. Even I get tongue-tied sometimes. I apologize about the confusion regarding your accommodations. The fitness gram pacer test is a multi-stage aerobatic capacity test that progressively gets more... Huh? That's random. However, it may take a while longer before you receive the proper room assignment. 
Is there anything you'd like to ask? Um, I saw something odd. You saw something strange. I like saw what? tombstones. Tombstones? No, coffins. You were probably just tired. <laughs> it's because I haven't. I don't have my persona yet. Now they're trying to gaslight me. It's bad for your complexion, you know. Something doesn't seem Do right. You have another question. Uh, why did you come Welcome here? Welcome you, of course. Speaking of which, where's Mitsuru, Yukari? Probably busy. She's upstairs. As diligent as always. Although it doesn't hurt to come down and say hello. Do you have another question? Uh, sure. Who else lives here? Four only four students in this dorm. Oh my god, this dorm should like not even exist if it's only that many students. You, Yukari here, Mitsuru, and a senior named Akahiko Sanada. I hope the gaslighting, you toxic. Do you have another? Uh, I believe that was everything. Then I hope you have a successful and a successful school year. school year. We will. I guarantee. Now, excuse me. You must be tired from all the excitement. You should go to bed early. As they say, the early bird catches the bookworm. Please forgive the Close enough, fun. buddy. Close enough. I think you need to study English literature again. <laughs> <laughs> You'll get used to his lame jokes. <laughs> lame jokes. You should rest for today. You decide to return to your room and sleep. <gasps> oh, we get a little cute. I can't remember if they put that in the mail route before or not. Later at a certain room in the dorm dormitory. Working hard? So, how's she doing? She went to bed a little while ago. She's asleep. Me? Now. Mr. Chairman, do you think she's Well, let's Hey, is anyone in this now. dormitory normal? Let's just say that. The dark hours. It, it would be possible. such a, a coincidence if, you know, all of us here are special. <laughs> Meanwhile, in the back alley of Tatsumi Port Island. <sighs> this sucks. Oh gosh. Upbeat music is playing from the radio that the man threw away. KJ Radio presents the Bay Tuners. Tune in again next week for more. The Bay, Bay Tuners? That sounds weird. Bay Tuners. This program is brought to you by Kirijo Electronics. Kirijo Electronics, always there when you need them. Wish I was new to this game. Possibly me too. Um, I, I. I've played the male route, so I know things about the male route. I don't know much about the female route. Um, but it has been a long time since I've played the male route. It's been at least like three, no, four or five years, I think. So um, I do, I don't remember all of the details from the male route. So I can't really pinpoint yet uh, any differences from the male route. Maybe I'll, it'll, it'll, my brain will start refreshing itself later on. 33 hours since this game. Oh, you're not even halfway through yet. <laughs> Persona games are typically like 70 to 100 hours. I can't remember how long I played the mail route. I think it was for a long amount of time because I did spend a lot of time grinding. I do remember that. The dark hour. Huh? Dun 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 dun. Post apocalyptic what? Twilight Zone. What's happening to me? Oh. Oh gosh. Shoot yourself in the head, quick! <laughs> Back at a certain room in the dormitory. Hmm. Let's go! She's still sleeping. The dark hour occurs every day at 12 midnight. You could say it's the hidden hour. During this time, an ordinary person transmogrifies into a coffin and is oblivious Imagine to all every night you go through that bleeding pain and you never remember it. Then she must be... As you can see, she's retained her human form. Me! She's asleep, but she's definitely experiencing the dark hour. The only question that remains is whether or not she has... Immediately, the they're like, we're accepting a dorm student. We need to see if, if we can initiate them or not into our group. Although she must. If she didn't, they would have preyed on her by now. Scary. <laughs> Nightmare feel? Oh god. In any case, we should continue to monitor her for a few more days. Wait, that just reminds me. They put a camera in her room if that's the case, right? Jeez. Yes, I feel kind of bad, though, spying on her like this. <laughs> yeah, you should, buddy. Especially you, old man. That's creepy. 
Uh, was that voice acted? Oh. Master Katone Shiomi. I don't remember if this is a boy or girl speaking. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, by the way, how does the audio sound? D does the voices sound good? Can you hear them over my voice? Oh, it's Igor. <laughs> That's right. Welcome to the Velvet Room. My name is Igor. I am delighted to make your acquaintance. I remember when Persona 5 first came out and people were so mad about the voice change, yet, <laughs> yet they, uh, I guess it's a spoiler if I say any more, but <laughs> I remember they flipped at the voice change. And reality, mind and matter. Only those who have signed the I contract signed a contract? Hey, a suspicious place. little boy gave it to me. And I signed it without any questions. Henceforth, you shall be welcome here in the Velvet Room. The Velvet Room. You are destined to hone your unique ability, and you will require my help to do so. I only ask one thing in return. Your heart. That you abide by the <laughs> contract. And assume responsibility for My the God, guys, you make. capitalism and corporations are still at the top, even in fiction. You'll never see it coming. Hold Oops. On to this. Well, I guess I do understand. <laughs> I actually picked a choice, but I guess I would have chosen that anyways, because nothing phases me. There is still one more resident of this room who unfortunately could not be present for your arrival. But I'll make sure you two are properly introduced. Another time, perhaps. Till we meet again. Another person. Is it Elizabeth? 